Okay, so here's my update. I am still at the hospital. They are keeping me 23 to 26 hours is what they said. Um, it took forever to get me out of recovery. Um, I was fully awake during the whole procedure. They use a C-arm that just kind of x-rays and it's like, and um, it did not hurt much at all. Um, the Novic or the lidocaine that they put to numb you up, I think is the worst part. And it's like, if you deal with serious pain, it feels like a bee sting. Like, it's not bad at all. Um, I got Dilaudid, so my, my pain medicine is Dilaudid. Um, that's what they're putting in my pump when I get a pump. Um, now, um, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, my pain levels. Okay, so I have fibromyalgia, and I have chronic back pain in my thoracic region of my back. Um, the fibromyalgia makes me have pain in my lower back, in my knees, in my ankles, my shoulders, my wrist. Uh, okay, from the waist down, like, uh, my legs feel like they I've got medicine in my system. Not to mention, I have the narc itch, so I'm itching. But the thing of it is, is it's not my nose itching. It's my legs. But my lower back pain is gone. Completely gone. Now, the reason I got this is the thoracic region pain. Um, at this point, I think it's done... Um, when I came in, I was about a seven or eight, uh, for pain. At this point with the Dilaudid, I'm down to about a four. So we're about 50%, um, at this point. Um, as I sit in this bed longer, 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 um, my pain may or may not get worse or get better. Um, it's going to be hard telling. Um, but that's where I'm at right now. I had my injection shortly after 8. Um, it is now almost 11.25. Um, I've been in this room since, um, this is my overnight stay room, um, that I have to stay in at the hospital. I've been in this room since probably about 10.30. That's how long it took me. Um, but the procedure, like, I kid you not, it is so easy. Like, it, I, and I was aware and awake the whole time. And I was talking. Like, I asked the doctor. I was like, hey, doctor, what are you doing? He's like, oh, well, at this point, I'm putting um, the port in your back a little bit farther in your um, so I could put the medicine in it. Oh, okay, cool. Yes, I really did ask that question. And yes, that really was his answer. Um, so overall, I see some improvement. Um, I will tell you that, uh, my legs are a little shaky. Um, they're not numb. They're not tingly. You could just feel the medicine in my system. So, um, they have me in as a fall risk, um, because I got morphine. So, um, any questions, comments, concerns, um, I'm here and so far it's good. So, um, at this point, if things keep going the way they are, I will schedule, I will go ahead and when the doctor comes in to see me tomorrow, I will go ahead and schedule, um, in a month to get the permanent put in unless something changes. That's what's going on. That's my pain pump trial update. And I will update you guys probably um, in a couple hours, about five or six hours, if, or like before I go to bed. If not, I will definitely update tomorrow morning. So, all right. Well, thanks for uh, watching. Thanks for Karen and uh, for the pain pump support group. Um, that's what's going on. So if you guys have any comments, questions, concerns, please let me know. Uh, 
Um, and if you guys have anything you want me to know, let me know. Thanks.